Hey, Jeff here, and this, I guess, is my version of the fireside chats of yesteryear. You know, I've been seeing a lot of Facebook. This has been a crazy election year. Um, a lot of, a lot of uh, vile things on Facebook, and I am here to make Facebook fun again. You know, I made that commitment not to do any political posts on my, on my feed, and I haven't. Um, I can't say I've kept myself from making comments on other people's feeds, but I'm, I'm finished with that too. I'm done with seeing all the negative things on Facebook, so I'm just going to keep my page positive about health and wellness, about fitness, about nutrition, about Juice Plus. You know what I feel about that. Amazing, amazing company and whole food product that is just no one can compare to. Um, that's the challenge I give everyone out there today, too, is, you know, we all know who we're going to vote for, and there's, no one's going to change my mind on who I'm going to vote for. Um, you know, if you want to continue to, and I'm talking to anybody out there, to just put, you know, lies up on Facebook, you know, if you want to tell me what your candidate is, gonna, is promising to do for the country, I'll read it. But other than that... It just kind of bores me to death, you know. It's not going to change my mind, and I doubt that if I say anything, it's going to change anybody else's mind. That's the way it is. I could have a conversation with somebody about it, but, you know, most people don't want to have a conversation right now. Um, but anyway, that off to the side. Again, my page is dedicated to health and wellness, and actually my sub-page is Complete Health and Wellness, and it's called Health and Wellness for Life. And... Um, you know, like on my personal Facebook page, I do some other humorous things on there. But on my Health and Wellness for Life page, it is strictly about that. And that's what I have decided for myself to do. And I think it's, it's one of the most important things or more important things that we can do, you know, for this country is to everyone try and just be a little bit healthier. Why not? What do you got to lose? You know, if you're if you're overweight and you lose a few pounds, you just put yourself in a better position not to get a certain disease. If you're on the fence for type 2 diabetes, let me tell you something that's very, very preventable with diet and exercise. So if you're diagnosed with that pre-type 2 diabetes, don't just get on a medication. Try diet and exercise. You know how powerful that would be for you to be able to take control of that so that you're not paying a fortune all the time in healthcare. And if everyone were to do that, if everyone were to do the simple things that we need to do, whether it's drink more water, eat more fruits and vegetables, and you don't need to change that overnight, and don't believe anybody that tells you that, that you have to make all these changes overnight. If you started tomorrow drinking a little bit more water every day, and then the following week you decided to eat one extra apple a day, who couldn't do that? And if the following week you decide, okay, I'm gonna walk three laps around the track because you have haven't been doing even that you know what a change that would make in your health and what it what a benefit that would be to the whole health outlook in this country so that's my pledge is to keep continuing to push health and wellness that is really what I want to do is to, to give you tips about health and wellness that's what this YouTube channel is about so I would love for you to follow that subscribe to that YouTube channel Follow me on my Facebook pages, and you know I'm on Twitter and so forth. Um, fire questions at me. I don't know everything. I don't claim to. I'm not the fittest person in the world. I don't claim to be. Um, I know there's always somebody out there that's that's going to have lower body percentage fat. And you know what? I'm 48 years old. I don't need that. Um, but I do want to be able to remain healthy, healthy and well. I think I said that right. Um, and to be able to pass that along to anybody who is open to learning about it and learning about what simple things you can do to remain healthy. All right. I would love for you to, again, follow this YouTube channel. It would be great. I'd appreciate it. And we'll talk to you again soon.